Fire crews are still on the scene of a major blaze that broke out yesterday at a church in Concord. KPIX 5 reporter Kit Doe has the latest on the investigation. This is day two of the investigation into the fire at the Church of the Nazarene in Concord. There's so much wreckage and debris, they haven't been able to sift through much of it. At this point, more questions than answers. Contra Costa County Fire sent in a search dog this morning just in case. The property has a history of homeless people breaking in and camping out inside the building. So we've had a cadaver dog go through. They've been able to clear about 25% of the building. Uh, there were no hits, um, but we'll continue to use that dog throughout the day to make sure that there was no one uh, located inside the building at the time of the fire. The fire broke out yesterday at 5.30 a.m. and quickly went to two alarms. By the time firefighters arrived, much of the building was engulfed on the inside. It took crews several hours to snuff out the stubborn flames. So far, no word on the cause or where the fire started. The night before the fire, um, the property maintenance person did run a transient off that was hanging around the building. That's the only reason we need to eliminate that we didn't have someone inside the building at the time of the fire. Firefighters saved the adjacent offices and the main sanctuary. Pastor Janelle Maher is not angry and passes no judgment on whoever may have caused the fire. Whether you follow Jesus or not, we have to accept that life is going to throw things at us that we're not expect like we're not expecting. Because we do follow Jesus, we believe that we're called to be gracious. We're we believe that we're called to be a people of faith, and we're really a family. In Concord, Kitto, KPIX5.